the Tornu, Torno, Torno cover that I'm going to install on the F-150 delivered today. So here it is. Those are the, the two rails that I have to install on the sides. And here's the actual box, the giant big box with the actual roll-up cover and the directions and everything else. So here you read the directions and then we will, maybe this weekend, put this bad boy on the truck. First thing I need to do is install these clamps on these rails. So they just kind of clip on here, slide them, and now we tighten it up with an Allen key. That's it. Now we do the other rail. I flip this bad boy over. Like that. Slide it forward. Back left. First thing, right now, you've got to snap these rails into the box. Which, let's see if I can do this. Now that those tracks are in, we'll take uh, the screws and screw them in tight. Now we lift it on a truck. But I don't have a truck. Jess has it somewhere. <laughs> Now we gotta screw this in here. Got all the clamps on. No, no, not exactly. Vertical, but I guess you're not supposed to. Now for these little kickstands. Take that off. This slides in here. Washer, lock washer, wing nut. Stand up. This just just supposed 
to push off the wall to make this rail level. Take this drain tube, thread it on this little guy. They want us to lubricate underneath these little rails. So I just get a little piece under there. The next step is to install these drain tubes. I'm in the, I'm in the, underneath the, you're in here, here. The problem is in the front of the truck here, I have no place to thread these two. Nowhere to train out. The only option would be to drill a hole in the bed of my truck, which I'm not particularly excited about doing. I mean, unless I just drain these into some bucket or something, but that seems terrible. So I don't know. This gear goes up in here like this. And then you turn it, and then that's it. But it's got to go somewhere. No, I don't know. Okay, now for the cover plate. Top of the box. This thing just sits here. All right, now I just gotta screw it in. All right. Well, there it is. All installed. Still got to figure out something with these drain tubes up front though. I don't know. I probably might just end up having to drill a hole in the truck bed, but we'll see. And then here's the pull cord, which they give you a little piece of Velcro so that you can keep it out of the way when you're loading the truck. So let's see how it works. Grab that. say it's 100% watertight but pretty good whatever we put in here we're still gonna have to put you know in, in waterproof bins but and it's you know semi-secure right this is aluminum vinyl on top of aluminum you can't open it unless you open the tailgate the tailgate can be locked so you know that's all she wrote and then to uh, open it there it is right here Thank you.